Hello beautiful people, I hope you're doing well and welcome back again to OnHot channel. For people that don't know, my name is Enes, I'm working for you. So if you have any questions, any video requests, make sure to drop them below in a comment. I will be happy to make a video for you. And for people that don't know, welcome back. You already know, if you have any questions, make sure to drop them below. I will be happy to make a video for you as well. Same as the over 100 videos I made now on Shopify customization. They were mostly requests from subscribers. Some people not even subscribers, but I'm fine with that. Just a like button, that's all I'm asking. And in this video, I will show you, which is a request again. In this video, as I said, I will show you how to add an extra search bar on your Shopify store. Because some teams, some, I mean, premium teams, I already have that option. But it costs like $350 for a team. That can be expensive for some people. So you can guys afford me. I'm free. No worries. So as I said, I will show you how to add an extra search bar with the title and so on. On your Shopify store and you can place it on any section you want no worries and without any more talking let's just jump to it as you can see this is the Shopify dashboard by the way and this is the team that I do all the demonstration on which is down team the 15 version which is the last now last one as if now but below here I have other teams as well which is taste sense refresh spotlight and trade and if you are wondering why is that because I do actually try the each trick on my channel on all of these teams behind the scenes so I don't bore people out in the video so as I said in demonstration I do it on down team but behind this because it's the most used ones the most used ones and the most requested one when it comes to tricks and stuff so in the video I do it on down team but behind the scenes I do try it on each one of these so even if you're not using down team it should work for you just fine no worries and even if it didn't, just drop me a comment. I would be happy to help you out. So as I said, I would show you how to add an extra search bar, right? Let me show you what I'm talking about. So by the way, if you are interested in how to, to show, sorry, show the search bar instead of search icon on your Shopify store on the header, make sure to check out my channel. I already made that video as well as making transparent header. And if you scroll down, it's not transparent. If you scroll up, it is transparent. I just posted that video and it was a request as well so let me show you what I'm talking about so uh, let's just say I want to add a search bar here here above collections so if I scroll down it will be a search bar a big search bar here and the title of course so we will do that by using a custom call obviously because this option is not available on the team uh, editor or team customizer as I should say so let's just keep this page open we will do the trick come back actually we don't have to do that so let's just uh, get back to Shopify dashboard. Then the next thing you're going to do is click on customize. You might be thinking, hold on. Uh, well, he said it's not available on team customizers. No, it's not. It's not available, but <laughs> we will do the trick from here. So after you did access the team editor, the first thing or the second thing you should do is make sure to find the place where you're going to place the search bar, right? So uh, just... Uh, Scroll down and see where it, where you want to place it. For example, as I said, I want to place it below the, the future products collection. So in here, then click on the plus button at the section. And hold on, he said it's not available. What he's doing? Just hold on, just wait a second. So in here, you will see some sections or snippets. Simply scroll down and click on custom liquid. And if this option is not available on your team, make sure to check out my channel. I made that video like a year ago on how to add this custom liquid section if it's not available on your team. And most of the teams now have it. So simply click on it and here we go. So this is the space where we're going to add the search bar. But hold on, where are we going to add the search bar? Again, scroll down description box and you will see a link named as cold. Then simply click on it and it will take you to this page right here. Or you're gonna see a very short code or very long code, sorry. And this code will actually have the search bar uh, in custom location. So let me click, the, uh, the second thing you're going to do, click on raw option right here, so make it easier to copy the code. Just click on it, then click on your keyboard. Uh, if you are Windows, click on Control A. I'm on Mac, I'm gonna click on Command A, and it will highlight or select the whole code in the page, then right click and copy. After that, get back to the, uh, the section we did create, the custom liquid, and simply paste it in the custom liquid section here on the top right corner. So simply pasting the code in here, and after a couple of seconds, it should show up. Here we go. As you can see, here is the search bar. And if you think there is space in here, it looks huge, taking too much space. 
simply use the option, the padding option is here. So let's just uh, make it smaller from the top as well as the bottom. More at the bottom, I think. Oh, that's too much. No, it's fine. No, it's fine. Let me click on the save button. And let's just get back to Shopify store, reload the page. And here we go, a custom search. And if you want to edit this title, this title that you see right now, search, because I know some people want to do that, simply get back to the team right here to the dashboard, then click on the three dots on left of customize and click on edit default team content. The last option, click on it, then simply use the search bar here search type in search and after that scroll a little bit down and here we go general section uh, general and here it says search then edit this text however you want in any title you want and that's how you add a custom search bar on any section on your shopify store without using any apps or anything like that and if you have any questions make sure to drop them below but for now i think my job is done so thanks for watching catch you on the next one